School Media has over the years been an organization that is passionate about fostering the growth of education in Nigeria through technology, innovation and creativity. The items donated include 20 laptops, 3 bicycles, 10 walkie-talkies, 8 security searchlights, 10 raincoats, 10 security buttons and 20 security whistles. The project director of School Media Limited, Mr. Moses Imae, said quality education can only thrive in a safe environment and that a safe environment enables educational success for students. And as part of our commitment to enhance quality education and providing the right tools so that again our teachers and school administrators can have the right tools to be truly globally competitive so that they can do the work, the good work that they seek to do. We'll also be donating, as we believe, that a safe security, a safe environment enables educational success for students. The PTA chairman of the benefiting school, Mr. Olisa Anene, expressed the light that the equipment will enhance service delivery in the school and that the donated items will go a long way in improving the learning process in the school. I feel very happy, like I said, and I'll give my address. It's a thing of joy for us to have the equipment. Uh, personally, I've been, it's been long, I've been expecting it. Yeah, because uh, my fellow parents are the ones contributing for the equipment to be delivered. And now that it has come, I'm very happy. And uh, you can be rest assured that in our general meeting, I'll tell the parents that we have the equipment for our security team. And at least our children, will be sure that our children are, are you know, more secure. And the security men can communicate among themselves with the working talk. They can equally run around the college with the, with the bicycles provided. For School Media Limited, education is pivotal to the growth of any economy and the organization says it will not relent in offering its services to the educational development of the country. In Lagos, Saratu Jeremiah, NTA News.